All right, people, welcome back to some more webcam duels. And yes, you are reading that title correctly. Neo Swaz, I'm going to try it one last time. One last time. Uh, we're, we're using a lot of cards that have the potential of getting hit on this upcoming list, but we are going to try this. Uh, we're also trying something new uh, with the webcam. So, uh, you know, last time it didn't go so well. Uh, pretty much I recorded it, and uh, it was kind of like it didn't work with Camtasia, and I only could record with the webcam, right? Uh, using the webcam's mic, so I was like, you know what? Let's just try to splice it. Let's try to splice it. It's not like I haven't never spliced before. So pretty much, uh, I'm recording with the webcam. Webcam's recording my audio recording, right? And then I'm also recording Camtasia with my uh, snowball mic. And pretty much, I'm gonna mute my webcam's uh, uh, audio and then just have this and then just put it together and hopefully it will. Uh, wow. All right. Well, thanks. And hopefully it will go well. Oh. Uh, Odd Eyes Heretics. Okay, that's weird. That's really weird. Okay. Alright, that sucks, but... Uh, it really does suck. You don't have to show me your... Uh, oh, I'm gonna leave, so allow me to show you my entire bag. So, Odd Eyes uh, Heretic Magicians. Weird. Anyway, I was gonna go ahead and pitch this. Summon, uh... You know, summon Armageddon Knight, of course. Go ahead and set and get set up. Get nice and set up. Uh, but, like I said... This is my last time trying Neo Swiseman. Uh, not only are we doing triple insta fusion with the Noden, but you know we're also doing a lot of Avalo chain plays. There's just a lot of things that will make this deck fall apart on the, possibly on this upcoming balance. Like if Noden gets hit or insta fusion gets hit, nope. If Lava Chain gets banned, nope. Because I'm gonna be especially especially Lava Chain is very key play in this deck. I need to put the Neo Swiseman on top of the deck. Neo Swiseman has to be on top of the deck. He helps me get set up. I need him. I am using the wrong deck, like really, like wow, I am, I am, wow. I said Neil Swiseman set his default, and then they were like, no, 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 let's not. Like, oh, okay, thank you, Dion. <sighs> yeah, that's what I'm saying, what the fuck? <laughs> so, last time, last time, I at least want to summon Neil Swiseman. And you know, it's still probably one, really inconsistent, but hopefully with a wobble chain, being able to put the Neo Swiseman on top of the deck. Uh, you know, the revival cards being able to summon you Bell out of the graveyard, you know, Prisma copying Neos. Hopefully it will go okay. So uh super number generator here, just like I wanted to go ahead and be so um, hmm. I say if I if I had if I had a little bit of uh Neo Swiseman already, I might be able to pull something off. If I had Neo Swiseman in my hand and really like at the end of the day that's literally what it came down to. It's just, you know, Neo Swiseman uh being a little bit inconsistent, you know? And that definitely does suck when, you know, uh, Neo Swiseman is super inconsistent. I guess I'll go ahead and activate Mound of Down, so, you know, when he kills my Mr. Tomato, I'm only running one Mr. Oh, I think I run one Mr. Tomato, one Dark Greffer, and one Armageddon Knight, because sending to you about to the graveyard isn't as important. You know, it's still kind of important, but not as important. Just gonna go ahead and throw the MST at me. That's fine. Ew, now I gotta duel against Burning Abyss? Like, really? Okay, so special summon, special summon, go into Dante. Yay, Burning Abyss. Wait, you didn't even mill. Like, you didn't even use your effect. Okay, you take a hundred. Like, ew. Take a hundred. You ran into Mr. Tomato, who had a hundred more defense than your attack. Like, like wow, you didn't even use Dante's effect. I mean, you special summoned both of them, so you guess you're like, you know, why, why should I? You know, I got Prisma, so I can kill the Dante right now. But then all the effects are gone. So who, you're, uh, okay, I've already Phoenix Wing boss. Sure. What do you want to put on top of the deck? Sure. That's fun. That is totally fine. So, who do you have? You have Cow Cab. Who says, this card says you can target one spell, chop card on the field, and turn it to hand, which I can just simply activate again. Scarm will get you the tour guide surge. Dante will probably grab you back your Scarm. So, still not looking good. Still not looking good. Also, you're in defense. That's in defense. Because you did attack. So, I can't even run you over if I wanted to. And I don't want to shuffle my deck either. No, I'll just go ahead and take the damage. I'd rather go ahead and have the Mystic Tomato. Because once I summon the Yvel, there's not much you can do against it, you know? 
So do you want to go ahead and use Dante's effect now? Like I said, Burning Abyss, just like, ugh. Ugh. Mm-hmm. You want Cow Cap effect or no? 2500 and 800. And Dante goes to defense. Alright. Man, I guess I can go. I don't want to. I don't, the thing is, I don't even want to kill his freaking Skarm. Like, I just want to take a duel slow, you know? Like, there's not a lot that I want to do right now. Really, I just kind of just want to get you Bell set up. So to get you Bell set up, I'm going to be summoning you Bell, so I don't have to worry about that. Really, I just need to make a Lavalo chain as soon as possible. I have the Neos. I have the Ubell. I'm going to have the Ubell when he kills my Tomato. I'm going to summon Ubell, of course. So I have that. You know, that play is totally set up. So literally all I need to do is uh, just get Neos Swiseman to my hand, like usual. So we need to start doing some Lavalo chain plays, and we'll be ready to go. Ugh. <sighs> So, so Neo Swiseman still a little bit shaky just because you know how it is, but hopefully with Mount of the Bound and shit like that, hopefully we can go ahead and pull something off. I'm assuming he's activating Fire Lake, but it doesn't matter if you click because I'll still get my search because you can't negate, so you can stop, stop, stop. I still get the search. Holy shit. He's literally clicking the living shit out of my shit. I can clearly see what you're doing. Sure, I'll go ahead and get Armageddon Knight. You can't negate spell. You you don't negate it. You don't negate my you negate my spell. Wow, my spell. Holy shit! Destruction is not negation, fucking scrub. Like wow, wow, wow. Ever heard of? Ever heard of? MST doesn't negate. <laughs> huh? Ever heard of that? Like wow, fucking fucking scrub. Just pick up Burning Abyss and fucking play. So now so you don't want to activate. So you so you don't want to activate. So you don't want to use Fire Lake. I said, do you want Fire Lake or no? I'm so confused. Do you want Fire Lake? Yes or no? Okay, fine. Fine. Fine, whatever. I'll allow it. It's just like, oh my god, go. You're still in defense, but whatever. Okay, it's still just fucking burning abyss. <sighs> so definitely gonna go ahead and gonna need that, uh... That Neo Swiseman. Quicker get Neo Swiseman, you know? The quicker I get Neo Swiseman, the quicker I can go ahead and, uh... Wow, are you shitting me? So you're not gonna mill with fucking Dante, so you take 300, like, wow. You can't do that during the battle phase, you fucking scrub. Wow, wow, you're so bad. Fucking scrub. Fucking scrub. Go ahead and summon you, Bell. It's like, wow. Like, wow. Are you seriously that bad? Don't take effect during battle phase? Like, that's what I'm saying. That's the problem. People pick up these top tier decks, think that they are all good with it, but they fucking suck. Like, I'm sorry. These top tier decks, they actually take some fucking skill. Now what? They actually take some fucking skill. Like, shock, they take skill? Like, wow, Dante's effect during battle phase. You guys didn't know you guys can do Dante's effect during battle phase? You didn't know that he was a spell speed 2 monster? Oh, wait, he's not?
Ah, uh, yeah, I just need the Eos Wiseman. Like I said, if, if I just had a fucking Insta Fusion. Like I said, I'm relying on Noden, Insta Fusion, going to the Mavala Chains. That's what I need to start relying on, but clearly I don't even have it right now, so. At least I can go ahead and summon the monster and not have to worry about him running me over. The only thing I have to worry about is Fire Leg right now, but he can't even target my Yubel, so he can go ahead and destroy my Mound to the Bound, but he can't destroy my, uh, my Yubel, so that's going to be on the field. The question is, am I going to am I gonna allow to tribute it, you know? You know, that is the question. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, you're... Are your effects mandatory? No, you can. So all of a sudden, now you get your effects? Like, okay. All right, so you didn't want them before when you activated the effect during the battle phase. Like, you're so bad. And now you get them on my turn when they have already would have resolved and you decided not to activate their effects. Like, oh, yeah, sure. Sure. God, you're fucking bad. Like, wow, this is actually fucking sad how bad you are. I said, if I can go off Neo, pull off Neo Swizen right now, that'd be great. So I just need Neo Swizen in hand. Like I said, if it's a contact fusion, I'd have it. But, you know, it's in my deck. It sucks. So I'll go ahead and summon Armageddon Knight. Good effect. So if you want to go ahead and activate Fire Link, go ahead. I don't care. Wow, and I was gonna draw a freaking. I just. Uh, give me this Insta Fusion. Like, please. Give me that Insta Fusion. Go ahead and send Street Patrol. Please, for the love of fucking God, I would love that fucking. Uh. Insta Fusion. Like, way I could pull off fucking Neo Swizen. Said. Running Abyss, they, they're, they're pretty skillful le decks there, so. And, uh, for now, I'll go ahead and just say you battle back on self. But of course, I can't be destroyed, so. Because it's bound to the bound, so you battle can't be destroyed. I guess you didn't want Skarm effect, so that's fine. Like I said I was going to leave it to you. I'm not responsible for telling you when to do your shit. Unless it's mandatory and they're all optional, so you can, so that's not my job. You better not say, oh, it's going for it. Like, no. No. That is specifically during the end phase, and it was going to be more in my end phase, but you didn't get the effect. You didn't want it. You just really wanted to draw your effect. Whose effect? No, no, no. It was, oh my god, during my end phase and you chose oh my god chose not to get it you drew that's not during the end phase i ended my turn you should have went scarm effect that's fine now the shit's irreparable game stakes i'm not even sure if you put grass so hopefully when you go ahead and summon this this is actually what'd you put on top of the deck i can't remember i think you put drag or yeah libic that's who you put that's fine like wow oh yeah oh oh yeah yeah because you because you can totally because you can totally summon and face up defense summon and face up defense why are you so bad like really really you guys didn't know you guys could summon and face up defense position oh no because you can't like, wow, wow, wow. This is what happens when scrubs use good decks. Like, wow, you're just fucking terrible at Yu-Gi-Oh. Oh, there's Insta Fusion. Question is, I don't really want to do it right now, per se. It's because he still has that fire, like. Hmm. I'm not worried about the Dante. When I pull off Neo Swiseman, then I can handle the Dante. Lubick's not going to do anything, so I'll probably just kill him. Probably just going to summon Grafford, then he'll go Fire Lake and then tribute these three and blow up, blow up, blow up. If he knows to blow this stuff, because of course he can't blow up the bell. Then, uh, what else will I do? He'll have no Burning Abyss on the field. He'll get a Burning Abyss from his graveyard to his hand, which is fine. Then I guess I could go ahead and. Yeah, then I would go ahead and activate Insta Fusion and put Noden on the top. 
Uh, the problem is he would have a card in his hand from Dante, so if he has one of them uh, counterable traps, and he's fucked. Eh, fuck it. Let's go ahead and see. So, normal summon? Okay. Hmm. Uh, still not worth activating it right now. Just go ahead and kill the Libic. And if he doesn't draw into uh, a Burning Abyss monster, then he can't even use the Fire Lake, so. Go ahead. I said, this is probably one of the worst Burning Abyss players I have ever seen. One of the worst. Mm. So you didn't draw into one, so you can't even use Fire Lake. A cool story, bro. Hmm. Yeah, I guess I'll go ahead and summon. I'm surprised I haven't got a single. Oh, okay, I got called, but the MST did during the early in the duel. Wow, and that's all you have is three Dantes. Like, nigga, nigga, you're so bad at fucking extra deck. Like, really? What are your birthday skilling? Okay. You can't you can't target you bell, so it's one of these two, so at least tell me who your birthday skilling. You wanna go ahead and break you skill my Neos anyways? Like sure fucking scrub. <clears throat> said, this is this is a bad burning of this player. That's it, I'm just waiting for you to quit. The quicker you quit, we can go ahead and get another duel in, but I'm not going to quit. I'll just beat your ass because you're a fucking scrub. So now I know all your cards. Hello? You can't. So, it's one of the other two. Which really doesn't matter, I don't give a fucking shit. So, so, choose the monster. So, alias or Armageddon. The choice is yours. As like I said, I'm assuming you want to go ahead and get that break to scale in the graveyard just so you can use it on your turn to kill. It's okay, that's fine. Or really, you two. Because I don't even need alias right now. Go ahead and go into level chain. Effect. Detached. Go ahead and put Neo Swiseman on top of the deck. At least I'm actually going to summon him. Oh, and Neo Swiseman can't be destroyed by card effects, so. <clears throat> that's going to be nice. Alright, that's in the grave. That's resolved. Thank you. And, uh, yeah, go ahead, so. Next turn, you're going to go ahead and get Neo Swiseman. So for the love of God, I hope you draw Burning Abyss Monster. Like, awesome. All right, you didn't, so. So next turn, I'll go ahead and summon Prisma. Prisma Effect reveals and Neos and Neos Wiseman. So, and summon you. We'll go, uh, Prisma Effect. All right, we'll go ahead and show you. My favorite one of the Neos fusions, Gas Neos, just because of the whole Rainbow Dragon misprint. Really love that shit. We'll go ahead and send Neos. And now. Neos Wiseman. There we go. Finally summoned him. Awesome. Who cannot be targeted by uh, effects, cannot be destroyed by card effects, and also he cannot be destroyed by card effects. So he can't be destroyed by card effects or targeted, which is nice and powerful. It's one of the reasons why I want to try this deck one more time, because Mounted Abounds, and, you know, it's been a cool minute since I actually used Mount, Mounted Abound, Mounted Abound, Brown, 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 Town, Creator. Hmm. But the thing is, I could possibly pull off another Neos Wiseman. Yeah, if I go to the Wobble Chain Effect, Detach, put a Neos Wiseman on top of the deck. I have to have a way to summon you Bell. Like, right now, I don't have a second way to summon you Bell. I c it would take me two turns to summon another Neos Wiseman. That's fine. Because we have not really drawn any revival. 
yeah, we run two U bells in this deck just because Stag and Street Patrol. So if I draw one, I can just send it and it's special summon it. You know, and with Mound of the Bound, you know, it's not like U bells much of a threat to herself. So, so I guess I'll go ahead and uh, kill you. Effect. That mon life points equal to that monsters. You take a no, no. You take uh. Really talks about it. Your quick damage equal to the attack. You take a thousand. I gain. Yeah. You take your attack. I gain the defense. You want Dante effect? I'm not gonna tell you because it's optional, right? If this card says a guy, you can target a bird and discard your graveyard, accept this card, and add it to your hand. So go ahead and get your effects if you want to. We'll go ahead and have chain attack. And uh go ahead. I guess you don't want Dante effect. Fuck him, fuck him. You don't want none of the burning abyss effects. Fuck it. So is that game? Now you don't want to set it. Okay. No monster that is being activated. Like, really? Divine Wrath? Like, no monster effect is being activated. What monster effect is being activated? Wow. 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 So bad. <laughs> it's actually kind of funny. I'm glad I'm recording this. You know you can't even activate Divine Wrath because nothing is being activated. Alright, so I can just go noting, noting someone, something else. I'm going to the wild chain, of course, put Neos Wiseman in on top of the deck. Special summon you Bell using uh, Stygian Street Patrol. Then Prisma will go ahead and send a Neos, which will, of course, will allow me to special summon another Neos Wiseman. So, you know, like, fuck it. I don't, I don't feel like killing him. I, I'm having fun doing Neos Wiseman. So, of course, summon Norden. His effect, who will summon doesn't matter because I'm literally just going to go into an XC, which is another Lava Chain. As I said, Lava Chain very important in this deck because I need to put Neo Swizen on top of the deck. I'll go ahead and detach the Norden just because if I get like a Revival card, then I can go ahead and, uh, and, uh, revive him and then he'll get his effect. So it's stupid. I wish I would have got more revival cards in this duel. I didn't get any. I got one call to hunted. No limit reverse. No, I mean, yeah, no limit reverse. No oasis. Like nothing. Uh, fun fact: Did you know that you can't activate cards randomly and just send them to the graveyard? Fucking scrub. Fucking scrub. Go ahead. I want someone to know Neil Swiseman. Fucking scrub. That's a fun fact for you. Uh, street. Oh, it's called Street Patrol. Street effect. So street effect. We'll go ahead. And uh, you can banish this card from your graveyard, especially on one fiend type with a thousand tap or less from your hand. So banish him. Special summon you bell. Almost some prisma. Effect. Once again, show you Chaos Neos. Go ahead and send Neos to become Neos. No, it was a terrible duel because you're a fucking scrub. Neos Wiseman again. Yay, multiple Neos Wiseman. Sure, I'll humor you, but yeah, that's it. Yay, multiple Neos Wiseman. So like I said, it relies a lot on chain. A lot on chain. So if, if the wild chain gets banned, fuck, I'm done. This deck is done. If, uh, if, uh... If Norden, you know, or Instafusion gets hit ahead of time, then I'm fucked there too. So it's, 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 this deck is looking a little bit shaky, but uh, maybe we can go ahead and pull it off. So for right now, go ahead in the comment section below. Go ahead and tell me what you guys think of the deck so, so far. Like I said, I didn't get the best of hands, but hey, at least I pulled it off. 
Uh, you got this fucking scrub ass burning abyss player over here. So, like, no, no, that was that was terrible. That was terrible. Uh, tell me what you guys think of the deck so far. Uh, if you guys want to see more, then I can go ahead and come back with uh, webcam duels and we can keep on trying to tweak this deck and and hopefully, you know, depending on the list, maybe you know, Law Chain won't get banned and. You know, Instant Fusion will stay at 3, and we can start pulling out the Revolver Chain plays easier, and maybe even put Neo Swordsman as a possible return of, you know, I'm still willing to get rid of Cosmic U-Bell, which of course is today's Y and Y, but, because it's just not really U-Bell centric, but, you know, you can't get more U-Bell centric than Neo Swordsman, which of course requires me to use U-Bell, so, uh, like I said, it's up to you guys, you guys want to go ahead and see more. So anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Webcam Dooms. I hope it was better. Like I said, I'm going to splice it up. It's going to be pretty much Camtasia recorded with uh, with my snowball mic, if you can see this. And then the webcam's recording with this mic. Mute that audio and use this audio. And then, you know, hopefully it'll be a fine episode of uh, Webcam Dooms. So if you want to see more Neo Swipe, then go ahead and tell me in the comment section below. And you'll be like, you know what, keep trying. It seems like you're really there. It seems like I'm close. You know, it seems like I'm definitely close. You know, the amount of the bounce help. Uh, you know, trying to exploit the number generator, Mr. Tomato, stuff like that. You know, uh, Law of Chain, setting up the Neo Swiseman. You know, with Neo Swiseman, Mount of the Bounds, not bad. And someone's ringing at my door. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and call it an episode and answer this door. So I hope that you guys enjoyed. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I will see you guys with the next webcam duels. All right, people. Thanks for watching.